U.S. stocks continue to cascade this afternoon as bond yields continue to climb on higher inflation. The biggest flush percentage-wise is actually the NASDAQ today. A lot of tech there. It's down almost 2%, and the dollar is also lower at the moment, and that's allowing the euro to get some edge in. It is up 0.35%, as well as the sterling. That is up 0.42%, and we will focus on the dollar-yen because we are expecting a rebound there. The pair has broken above an upper boundary of a triangle pattern, and it stands above its moving averages, calling for further advance. So we're going to favor long positions above 112.95, and the targets are 113.40 and 113.55 in extension. Bitcoin is at 6,659 today, and gold, even though we have a sell-off, our usual safe haven is under pressure because it is capped by its declining moving averages. So we're going to favor short positions below 1,192, and those targets are 1,185.50 and 1,182.50 in extension. Follow Trading Central on Twitter for all of your Forex market updates and for Trading Central Web TV in the middle of the week at the New York Stock Exchange. I'm Olivia Vosnenko.